Hello, everybody. Just the show before the show starts. The show is called TBR Solutions Sports Forum. And then uh, you know that myself is the sub the boys, when fancy. I just want to recognize Dunya Zen, whom we have used their footage just to show how Messi deserved what he just received last night. Uh, we just want to show you uh, how did he perform, uh, you know, for 2022. I thank you. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, the show is called TBR Solution Sports Forum. It is myself, the Sobri Boys, Wale Fatsi, together with Saddam, the president. I don't know whether should I say president or Swini, but not that Swini could have to say that. Then I also have uh, Tabiki. Uh, guys, <laughs> the show. Uh, let's start with you, uh, Saddam. Welcome to the show. Uh, morning, guys. Morning, everybody. Nice to be with you. Ah, yeah, but now we are moving now. Then uh, the sound is changing. Uh, I would like to say thank you to everyone. Who no, no, you were at the right. Oh, good no, no, it's cutting, but uh, no, Say it, guy. Uh, can you can you talk, Saram? Hello, you... morning, everyone. Can you hear me? Morning, no, everyone. No, the sound. The sound. Is good. Go back to the previous position where you were. All right. Uh, in the meantime, Tabiki, uh, let greet the viewers quickly. Let's move on quickly, guys. Time is against okay. us. Okay. What are you doing, Tabiki? I'm fine. I'm fine on yourself. And uh, good morning to the viewers. And uh, yeah, it's a happy uh, Tuesday. Goblin is Gardi Mangis when one on a gen a sound here. So good, sir. You are just now. Aish, Aish, Aish. Let's hope. Let's hope you'll be fine soon. Now, now. Yeah. Let's hope so. It's come move on well because mm. once you move, then you're messing it up. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, Saddam, come in. Come in. I get one of us wearing straight. Come in. Hmm. Hello, everybody. Can you hear me now? Clearly. I, I hear you, but you keep on, uh, you know, cutting a little bit. Fine. The, the previous position. Because I want you to participate today. Today, I want us to discuss something. Uh, just move, Saram, because um, I yeah. don't hear you clearly. Uh, I want yeah, to... I move to another position. Um, all right. Can you hear me now? Uh, it's, it's, it's still very rough. Tell tell me what's happening. What's happening this week? What is, what is the story? Now, the, uh, the story is a good news for after Saturday, but now we are going to Devon against uh, uh, Richard Bay. She to play Richard Bay on Saturday. We are leaving on Friday night. This is a story. 600 returned. Ten siblings are leaving in the in BB garage on Saturday night, I mean, Friday night, uh, 8 o'clock. All right, the sound is still not perfect. Get a better position. Uh, let me talk to Tabiki. Tabiki, we saw the game between Chiefs and Pirates while Saddam is still organizing himself. And then uh, Chiefs has yeah. won. And this is the fifth time that Chiefs won back to back. And then uh, Pirates without an answer. Uh, what do you say? Is it, is it, does it matter or will we make our own goal or penalty or offside as long as Revelar is the goal? So what's your take, Tabiki? Yeah, for me, uh, it, it was a goal. A goal is a goal, man. Even if I, even if the goal bumped me on my head without even seeing it and then it went inside the poles, mm. I mean, it's a goal at the end of the day. And then some of the people or Pirates supporters went as far as saying that, uh, the, the goal was an offside, you know, then they're just making arguments. They don't want to lose. Since Chiefs has, been, Chiefs has been beating them now, it's been five games in a row, and that has never been done before. So, you know, they must just give credit, you know. Even if Chiefs is not looking like a team that could challenge for Cups this season or however way uh, a person look at it. For me, Chiefs done, have, have, have done a good job over the weekend. Considering that they didn't even consider a goal against the, one of the most teams that has the best players in South Africa. So for me, it was a clear goal and it was a clear... The, the, the own goal shows that Chiefs has been dominating the second half. Pirates were playing 
uh, under pressure after the red card. So for me, it was a goal, you know, okay. and the Chiefs okay. deserved it. Let's yeah. move on. Let's move on. Saddam, I don't want us to talk yeah. about that game because I want you to talk about the topic that I've raised. Ibona, uh, you went on tweet. Uh, junior Chiefs. Where is Saddam? I don't see him now. Uh, on tweet, Saddam says, uh, Junior Kanye hates Kaiser Chiefs. He, he just wait for something goes wrong. And then uh, the next thing, he's all over Kaiser Chiefs. But now, the, I don't know. The question is, are we now suppressing his views? Tabiki, are we suppressing his views? Uh, no, we're not. Uh, sometimes he makes unnecessary comments, you know. So for me, uh, uh, he must just give credit. You know, we know that Atazwane, he's trying to build, or he is building a team. So he must just bear in mind that this is a building team. It's not a perfect uh, uh, team yet, or a team that you could say, um, can challenge for every trophy and stuff. So, but for me, he must just give credit. He must just not be negative most of the, because most of the time he's negative. So for me, ah, man, he must just step up. He must sometimes, if he does not have anything nice to say, he must just keep quiet. You know, but he that, must that, just that, keep quiet. I think is, my question is, yeah, his opinion. Now, do you want to suppress his opinion? No, sometimes I don't think it's opinion. I think he's being emotional. Maybe I don't know what's wrong with him. I think he's he's got something personal. Sometimes his views like he's got something personal with Kaiser Chiefs. Even if it's, it's he's talking the truth, we miss that he's trying to make a point because his opinion becomes more like he becomes emotional about them, you know. But that's it's like point, whatever Chiefs try. At some yeah, point he makes predictions, and those predictions they come to fruition. Yeah, it's more like Romania. It's mm. more like Romania. You know, he can make the numbers maybe for the YouTube channel and stuff or for his pages in the Twitter. But for me, ah, sometimes you must just... But, but, but Umbo, you know, it's not easy to be emotional about things. Yeah. Uh, Umbo, yeah. Umbo, 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 we don't know, but then sometimes when I mean, all right, you know, all right, all right. Let's you move can on. see that the team tried on yeah. Yeah, let's move on. Uh well um, I know that he's not a fan of Arthur Zwane, and I suspect, you know, once you played with Arthur Zwane, and then uh, if you guys were former players, you'll have your own pro uh, your own issue. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, if that is his opinion, we need to respect that. I don't have an issue mm. with Arthur. I think Arthur is doing a good job. Arthur has never done a, a bad job, as far as I'm concerned. Chiefs yeah. is a yeah. face, as far as I'm concerned. Just like Junior said at some point, that Kaiser Chiefs, they are in the rebuilding phase. So we need to allow that. Now let's move on. Yeah. To, you know what? I saw somebody. I've been asking about this guy, guys. You know, and then uh, uh, Steve Chicano helped me to... To, to get this guy, I even spoke to him. You know, Zero Mahiro Mahale used to play. Mm, with him. Mm, mm. This guy, ah, he was an exciting player, very exciting. There's one game I remember that they were playing Kaza Chief. You know, teenage was a problem. Teenage was a problem. When he gets the ball, <laughs> yes, yes, well, I was oh, a I would shiver, you know, all the way, <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> they should cause havoc. And then uh, teenage would take about six players, uh, you know. And then uh, mm. the next thing, uh, my hero would do the same thing, six players, and it'd give us some boost. I remember one of the yeah. games that we played against the Chiefs. It was a cup final. Maybe it was a, a top eight. I don't know whether it was BP top eight by then. And then we won 3 2. And then uh, my hero was excellent that day. Um, trophy Kumalo scored hat trick. And the third one, it was mm. a penalty. And then uh, we finally won the cup. So, yeah, man, I got this information via Steve Chicago. And then uh, I've spoken to my hero. Uh, I'm trying to make an arrangement that we interview him. Let's move on. Uh, Kaiser Chiefs, uh, they let's. they are going to have... I want to share the nine games that are remaining for Kaiser Chiefs. Here are the games. Just like Saddam was saying, they're going to Richard's Bay. They're leaving on Friday. 
I'm sure the guys in Tembisa are aware. Uh, from BP Garage, and then it, and then uh, so they go to Devon. They are playing Marisbeck United away, and then they are also playing. They are supposed to play. Uh, I mean, they are playing Richards Bay. Then they are going to play Marisbeck United. Mm -hmm. Stelis Maruma Gallants. I saw Maruma Gallants playing a very nice football when they were playing their uh, Kev game, and then there's Kukune, uh, Chipa, Swilo, mm -hmm. Super Sport United, mm -hmm. Cape Town City. So, what's your take? Do you think how many points do you think Kaiser Chiefs will get from this game? From all for me, K from this nine. Uh, for me, uh, my side, I think they might just collect twenty points or twenty three, mm -hmm. according to me. You know, they are very tough games. They are they are tough games there to, to to look at it, and then teams will also be trying to challenge for the top eight, mm -hmm. Kev Confederation, Kev Champions League, and then some of them will be trying to avoid relegation so it's only gonna get tougher you know mm -hmm. no so it's going to be it's going to be an exciting end to the to the to the to the to the end of the premier soccer league so mm -hmm. you know yeah good luck to them good luck to them but i hope they could they, they they get at least the calf confederation uh spot even second place is still also possible because you can see that from number two to number five teams mm -hmm. there they don't have a long distance between them in terms of points so yeah it's going to be a tough one, even if Parapet is also playing another Soweto Derby this weekend. So it's only going to get tougher versus Solo. So, yeah, it's going to be an exciting uh, match also there. Is it? Now, yeah. um, we'll see what's going to happen. And then um, now, when it comes to the league, you guys are admitting now that Mamelodi Sundowns has dropped the league now. Um, they are left with nine games and they need only nine points. And I saw Mamelodi Sundowns playing in Africa. Mamelodi Sundowns is a chair. You know, yeah. playing exceptionally well. And then uh, I will share the 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 the, the, the log of the calf a little bit later. Now I just want to share with you quickly. Um, you remember I was telling you about those grades, and then this is the guy who gave me uh, the information. Steve Sicano in the middle. Can you see Steve Sicano there? And uh, yeah, 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 he's busy with his um, uh, foundation, they're doing a very good job. And then, uh, mm. apparently, they, they were at Eugene Zwane's uh, 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 place, uh, his uh, place where he sells Chisanyama. Um, do you see uh, Pashin Mashangu? Uh, Ayashi Samate. So, this guy mm. is very mm. tiny, but uh, you know, huge shots. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Yeah, uh, she's a wet thing. Yeah. Not so, I know this guy was bad. And then uh, I also saw this man. Um very interesting. Wanderers club. Can you believe that Shagangov was playing for this club? And him and mm. Blaske, who was playing for Kaiser Chiefs, he also played for this club. And then uh, so it was exciting to see that. So those are the news uh, in the olden days. Yeah. So now. Um, I see guys, you guys have been going around complaining about Chip and Benghazi that, hey, uh, <laughs> but the fact of the matter is still in the league. So why are you complaining, guys? Ash, He's still too many the... coaches. Hmm? Too, too many coaches, man. He's firing. He does, he's, he does not have consistency. Uh, you know, what are because we're trying to see what kind of football Chip is going to give us. The moment the team is not doing well, he chases the coach away. He does not give them a chance to bounce back. Yeah. You know. But the yeah, fact so is, he's still in the in the in the in the in the competition. So you can't say one day is huh? one day is one day is one day. You mean Vera, so? that Africa will be waiting for him. Mutepe mm. Mutepe mm. uh, League will be waiting for him. As one a, day is one day. Wow. Yeah, this changing. This changing of many, just imagine in 12 years, 35 coaches. Oh, that's a lot. That is his team. You would say that. Uh, let, me share another, <laughs> let me share another soccer great. Eric September. I don't know you know this guy. This guy. Eric September. He used to be a, a, a number nine for Jomo Cosmos. And then yeah, when he yeah. the Cosmos, he was a bit of a cow, to be honest. But when, <laughs> he, was, when he was on his way out, I know. Temba was a very good player. That is why Sundowns 
uh, went to Jomo knocking. He was an excellent player. You know, Jomo has yeah. got an eye for brilliant player. So big up to Steve Sicano for organizing these guys, taking care of them. And then mm. uh, uh, what's his name again? Um, Eugene Zwane, um, you know, to entertain these guys. Now, let me share, share uh, Kev. Here is Mamluri Sundowns. That is why I say Mamluri Sundowns, guys, they are at another level. Here they are at number one with seven points. Al-Hilal, Al-Hilal at number two with six points. Al-Akhli at number three with one point. Cotton Spot with zero. What's your take about this? Uh, they've only played uh, only one, uh, what you call, um, uh, let me, I ju I'm just zooming in on the pictures. They only played three games each, ne? Yeah. So, oh no, it's mom, it's mom, lady sundown. So, no, uh, mom, for me, says, still... mom, son has played three and I'll yeah. ask you and they're still going to play their games. Uh, yeah. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, now points now, al Ahli is, um, one and then the sundown is at seven. All right. Yeah, for me, for, for me, for, for me, it's still too. Early. It's like let me just say it's halfway. So I still think I'll actually will see them in the quarters. I don't know whether it's Mamelu Sundowns who's going to stay or Al Hilal. But for me, Al Ahli, you know, after the game I saw on Saturday versus Mamelu Mamelu Sundowns, and Mamelu Sundowns are the best team in this group. So it means Al Ahli can still qualify. You know, Al Hilal, they're very, they're, they're a good team. They lost to Mamelu Sundowns, I think, uh, two weeks ago. So. Um, yeah, still a long way to go. We'll just have to see what happens in the next game. So, yeah. Do you think so? Yeah, uh, yeah. For uh, me, Al Ahli, I think they will be in the quarterfinal either way. Al Ahli will be in the quarterfinal. Now, yeah. let's go to uh, before. Uh, let's go to uh, the FIFA World Cup. Yes, 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 yes. And then uh, we want to see who were the best three? We know that who were the best three selected, and then we know by now who's the best player uh, who, took, who, who took the cup. And then, yes. Yeah, and deservedly so. And then you had Karim Benzema, and then you also had um, Kelly Mbappé, Mbappé, and then um, and also uh, Lionel Messi as the mm. the three uh, players. This is the courtesy of Super uh, ESPN. I got this from ESPN. We need to recognize mm. that. So Messi won with 52 points, and then Mbappe 44, uh, which is about how many points? Eight points, all right? And then mm. Karim Benzema was far behind the 34. Do you think was a, this was a fair result? For me, yes, 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 yes. But then I like the way Mbappe is getting close to Messi. You can see by the points there. You can see that no, Mbappe is definitely going to become the next best player here. So for me, yeah, well deserved by Messi. Yeah, the best also. Yo, I can see also the uh, the coach of uh, Argentina also got uh, the best award too. Even uh, Martinez, the goalkeeper, Emiliano, your favorite goalkeeper, Emiliano Martinez. Uh, he won the best FIFA goalkeeper also there. So yeah, I can see that Argentina making a. Uh, a clean sweep there. So yeah, in, nice work in, from Argentina. In England, it doesn't do well, man. Um, what is his name? I, yeah. Against uh, in 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 the in the, in the, like in, the in, in the in the EPL. Yeah, 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 yeah. They, they are boy, they are boy, they are boy, la paya. Uh, what's wrong with <laughs> him? Uh, because um, he's a very good goalkeeper. I like his jokes. Yeah. He's a very yeah. Guy, you know, <laughs> he's a very <laughs> funny guy. Now, deservedly so, Lionel Messi had to win this one. So mm. there was no uh, qualms or complaints uh, as far yeah. as uh, those who were complaining, it was a sour cream. I wonder where are the, <laughs> Penaldo, the Penaldo group? The Penaldo yeah, group. They're quiet. The Penaldo group, uh, I think they need to accept now. Listen now, Mbappe said immediately after this, he said he grew up uh, supporting Ronaldo. But now it's unquestionable. Messi is the man, is the main man. Yeah. See yeah. now they are now coming closer. You know, I think they understand now that they need each other more than to be mm. rivalry, uh, which is which is quite good uh, for me. Yeah. And uh, yeah, he was the winner of the tournament. 
And then, unfortunately, uh, I wasn't happy with uh, the fans. I played that clip at the beginning. Uh, Argentina. And we present the achievement of Lionel Messi. jumping on, 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 on somebody's car because the team has lost. How long? What do you say about that? Ish, man. That, that's, I don't know what happened, but then, you know, fighting is not right. That's the first thing we should just mm. look at it. You know, you mm. can see the Metropolis there. I mean, the JMPD is there trying to stop the fight, but yeah, they, were overpowered. They, were, they were overpowered by the Orlando Pirates supporters, you know, jumping on people's car. That's some um, barbaric, you know, Ish, I don't know what can I say. It was it, it was it, it was just wrong, Jay. The mm -hmm. whole clip you can see. I know people there were obviously angry. Some of them maybe had too much to drink, mm -hmm. so they were very mm -hmm. emotional. You know, I just hope that nobody got hurt or what, nobody got killed and stuff. Yeah. But we, I think we could have heard that from the media also. I hope I hope the police are doing their work. Uh, yes, yes. To get some confidence from them now, especially yeah. after what happened to Sense and Wheel. May you are, yeah. Uh, it's how long eight years ago, and no, 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 no results. We are still waiting to hear. And now we mm -hmm. are moving straight to the message special, all right? And then uh, yes, we are straight to that one as our last section. And I'm sure you are aware that something is missing. What is missing? Yes, the Momo, the, yeah, 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 yeah. I think I missed something, but I'll tell you, we'll talk about it offline, yeah. All right, now, let's see. Um, these are the soccer grades. Ramos. Now, you know something that excites me? 
Even those who are very close to Cristiano Ronaldo, they are waking up now. You yeah. Know, Ramos says Messi is the best of all time. Modric, you know, Modric at some point didn't want to wave. But this time he's, he's alluding that Messi is the best in history. And then Cruz, even Cruz, you know, these are all Madrid legends. I've never seen a footballer play as consistently as Messi. Raul, the former Madrid legend, mm. said, All players that have faced Messi is the best. Casillas, all these are, are, are Madrid uh, people. Casillas says, Messi is the best I've faced. He made me a better goalkeeper. Casamiro, of <laughs> course, the Brazilians, they love him. I know that. If you love football, you love Messi. And then uh, Benzema said, anyone who criticizes Messi does not know anything about football. Zinedine, I totally agree. Zinedine Zidane, I didn't expect this from him, said Messi is the most complete player I've ever seen. So uh, now it's history. So let's forget about Agi. Let me show you that Messi has titles that I don't think this will be broken. Players that won the World Cup are 471. Then players that have won the World Cup and the UEFA Champions League are 80. Players who have won World Cup, Champions League, and Ballon d'Or are nine. Players who have won a World Cup, Champions League, Ballon d'Or, Golden Boot, it's Messi and Muller. The players who have won everything, World Cup, Champions League, Ballon d'Or, Golden Boot, uh, uh, world best player, it's Messi alone. All right. <laughs> Remember the 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 main the main is a FIFA main player of the year award. He was taken for the seventh time, seventh yeah. time, Tabiki. So now you need to start admitting, Penaldo. I'm sending a message. <laughs> So Tabiki, thank you for the for the show. I appreciate. And then you want to say something before we leave? No, no, no. Thank you for a great show. Yeah, yeah. See you later. Yeah, thank you. Again, I want to ask if you want to get yourself ahead and try to make more money for yourself, you need to have multiple uh, income stream. So we as the Big R Solution using our sister organization which is the big r uh, foundation together with um, uh, mtn and um, francis we are giving you the opportunity to get momo it's a device equivalent to a small phone with that device you can be able to sell airtime you can be able to sell data you can be able to buy electricity you can be able to bet lottery you can be able to do bad ways you can be able to pay your DSTV. Uh, and there are quite a number of things that you are able to do. And in the process, you get yourself a commission. So it might look like a little bit commission, but a little bit makes something different. I always say to people, take care of the sense. The rents will take care of themselves. Thank you very much. And then uh, before I leave, thank you very much to you people out there for supporting us. There's one show that we did with Saddam and Tabiki. It is almost at 10,000 views. And guess what? We don't even boost them at 10,000 views. This is this is quite exciting. Tabiki, we need to pepper ourselves in the back. And thanks to the viewers for supporting us. We really appreciate it. Only you can make us to be what we want to be. I thank you. Hello, everybody. My name is the Sobre Boys, one fancy from a TBR Solution. TBR Solution is a financial company that helps people to be financially savvy. I'm sure these days you are aware that prices are very up in terms of petrol, in terms of goods and services, prices are very, very high. Now, these days, we are on a campaign to help those members of GPF or government employees especially if you are 55 years old or above and you are contemplating to resign or go on pension in three months time, give us a call or drop us a WhatsApp, then we'll call you back so that we help you to get your money expeditiously. 
you know, as compared to sometimes people get their money after a long time. We will then transfer your money from GPF to Allen Gray, whom we have a relationship with. And the good news is once the money has been transferred, you will choose how much you want to earn. If you happen to pass on, your spouse will also get the same amount. Then if it happens that both of you passes on, you would have appointed or selected uh, beneficiaries. It could either be your children or anyone else. And there's nothing like age limit that they must be 22 or below. Even if they're above 22, they'll be able to get the, 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 the inheritance from you. So that's how flexible it is. And then um, I know that sometimes people, they worry about medical aid and all that. We also have with other partners who assist you to get a medical aid. So if you want to learn more and get more information pertaining to that, just drop us a WhatsApp. We'll therefore come back to you. I thank you.